Type 2 diabetes is one of the most pressing health challenges of our time, affecting hundreds of millions of people around the world. It's a condition marked by the body's resistance to insulin, leading to chronically high blood sugar levels. That can cause everything from nerve damage to heart disease if left unmanaged. For decades, the standard approach to treatment has been a combination of lifestyle changes, such as diet and exercise, alongside medications like metformin, sulfonylureas, and in more severe cases, insulin injections. But in recent years, a new drug has taken the spotlight not just for managing blood sugar, but for the possibility that it could reverse the course of type 2 diabetes itself. That drug is Ozempic, a GLP-1 receptor agonist originally developed. To treat diabetes, but now just as famous for its unexpected side effect dramatic weight loss. The question on everyone's mind is this. Can Ozempic actually reverse type 2 diabetes? Or is it simply another powerful management tool in disguise? To understand the hype, we need to look at what Ozempic actually does. Ozempic who's generic. Name is semaglutide. Mimics a natural hormone in the body known as GLP-1, or glucagon-like peptide 1. This hormone plays a crucial role in regulating blood sugar levels. It stimulates insulin production when glucose is present. It suppresses the release of glucagon, which otherwise raises blood sugar and slows down. How quickly food leaves the stomach. Keeping people fuller for longer, so the result is not just better. Blood sugar control, but also significant weight loss. Clinical studies have shown that patients on Ozempic can lose an average of 10 to 15 percent of their body weight which is remarkable considering that excess body weight is one of the leading drivers of type 2 diabetes. In fact, some studies have suggested that when patients lose enough weight, their blood sugar levels can return to the normal range, which some experts describe as remission. But here's where things get complicated. Remission and reversal are not the same thing. Remission means that blood sugar levels are normal without the need for medication. But the underlying condition, the tendency for the body to resist insulins, till lingers in the background. Reversal would imply a permanent fix essentially curing type 2 diabetes, and science isn't there yet. For example, in a pivotal study published in the New England Journal of Medicine, patients with type 2 diabetes who took semaglutide for 68 weeks not only lost weight, but many achieved blood sugar levels in the normal range without requiring additional medication. However, when they stopped taking Ozempic, the benefits began to fade. Their blood sugar levels started to rise again, and in most cases, weight slowly crept back. This highlights a critical point. Ozempic may help push diabetes into remission, but it doesn't eliminate the disease. Once the drug is stopped, the underlying metabolic issues often return. Despite this limitation, the impact of Ozempic cannot be overstated. For decades, people with type 2 diabetes have struggled with treatment regimens that manage symptoms but don't address the root cause. With Ozempic, there's a pathway that actually changes the trajectory of the disease, at least for as long. As the medication is continued by promoting weight loss and improving insulin sensitivity, Ozempic tackles two of the biggest drivers of diabetes head-on. This is why so many doctors and researchers are calling it a game-changer. It's also why demand for the drug has exploded, not only among diabetes patients, but also among people seeking weight loss solutions, sparking debates about supply shortages and whether the drug is being used responsibly. Another dimension, too. Consider is how Ozempic compares with other interventions. We know from research that bariatric surgery such as gastric bypass, can put type 2 diabetes into long-term remission for many patients, sometimes for years. The mechanism is similar. Massive sustained weight loss improves insulin sensitivity and restores glucose control. But surgery is invasive, risky, and not an option for everyone. Ozempic offers a non-surgical alternative that achieves some of the same benefits, though typically to a lesser degree. What's more, the side effect profile of Ozempic includes nausea, vomiting, and gastrointestinal discomfort, which can be difficult for some patients to tolerate. There have also been concerns about rare risks, such as pancreatitis, 
and possible links to thyroid cancer. Though the data on long-term risks is still being gathered, so can Ozempic truly reverse type 2 diabetes? The most accurate answer is no it. Doesn't reverse the disease in the sense of curing it forever. What it can do, however, is induce remission for as long as the treatment continues. It's like hitting the pause button on diabetes, giving patients a chance to live healthier. Lives with lower blood sugar, less risk of complications, and often without the need for insulin injections or multiple daily pills. For many, that alone is nothing short of revolutionary. Still, it's important to manage expectations. Patients who stop taking Ozempic often see their diabetes return, which shows that the drug is not erasing the condition, but suppressing it. Looking. Ahead. Researchers are investigating whether earlier use of drugs like Ozempic could change the course of type 2 diabetes in the long term. Some speculate that if patients start treatment shortly after diagnosis, combined with aggressive lifestyle changes, it might be possible to extend remission for years or even decades. As others are studying whether combining Ozempic with other emerging therapies could one day lead to a more permanent solution. The bottom line is that while Ozempic is not a cure, it represents a massive leap forward in how we think about treating diabetes. Offering hope where there was once only management in the end Ozempic is neither magic nor myth it is a powerful tool, but not a miracle. It doesn't reverse type 2 diabetes permanently, but it can transform the way the disease is managed, giving patients real and measurable improvements in blood sugar, weight, and overall health. For anyone living with type 2 diabetes that might be as close to a miracle as modern medicine has ever come. The question isn't whether Ozempic can cure diabetes, but whether we as a society can use this breakthrough, wisely balancing hope with science and hype with reality. So what do you think? Is Ozempic the future of diabetes treatment, or is it just another overhyped drug with temporary effects? Let us know in the comments, and don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more deep dives into the science and stories shaping our health today.